Alright, it's been a long time since I have released a YouTube video. I've been kind of taking a break. I really do hope this this is good enough to make it to YouTube. I have never played Stardew Valley before. I've only heard that it's sort of like this game, Harvest Moon. Anyways, uh, yeah, I really do hope this one makes it to YouTube. Well, I want a simple standard farm. Okay, that's pretty interesting. It's been... I've also, it's been a long time since I played these types of games, like, sort of just a game that's sort of just like, an, like a Nintendo style game. It's been so long since I played this kind of game, and I'm really do, I am glad I'm back to playing this kind of stuff, because I really do like uh, playing these types of games. I like the skin color, feels more natural since it's more tan. Yeah, okay, let's try the hair, Afro Man. Alright man, okay, you know what, screw it, okay? Boom, okay, Afrojack here, the farm name. let to make him have like, white eyes, like, dead eyes like that, okay, that that's good. Let's look at this right here, he's staring into your soul right there. I tend to make the most ridiculous characters ever, pants color. You know, I know, oh my god, why, why can't you make me edit the... Why don't you let me add this the freaking shirt? Okay, uh, I think that's why. This looks kind of like Mario right here. Oh my god, 112 shirts, alright. Time to go. <coughs> yeah, this is the Luigi shirt right here too. Okay. I'm gonna do standard farm because I'm... I'm not very good at these types. Uh, how much hair do I have right here? I right, never mind. Uh, I have a lot of hair right here. Some of them looking RPGs. Ah, that's good. Afrojack. He's the coolest farmer ever. Alright, let's go. Ah, uh, yeah, I remember this. I, apparently, I've inherited something from my. From my bird. Yeah, apparently, like in this game, you uh, inherit a farm. And then. And you have to take care of that farm. Uh, can I open it with the sword over there that you have? Uh, I like to open it with that. Why do you have a sword, by the way? Modern life. I'm, I, by the burden of modern life. I'm on a farm here. I'm supposed to be on a farm. How is this modern life? Am I going to go into the city here? Why are you saying the modern life? Or is it what time is this in? I don't think modern life is. Also, why do you have an ant right there on the shelf right there? I, I have no idea what's going on there. Work, rest. That's what they mean by modern life. Ah. <coughs> so it's like whenever the time when I. Uh, okay. I didn't expect it to be like this. Okay. Jojo, Joja. <coughs> That's the company name. Life is better with Joja. Okay, yeah. <coughs> uh, Afrojack ain't having none of this. Look at some water. What am I supposed to do? Okay, nothing apparently. Ah uh, yes, open it up. Dear Afrojack, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of chains. The same thing happened to me a long ago. I'd lost sight of you what matter I lost sight of what mattered most of my life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and I moved to the place I really belong. <coughs> Sorry for the coughing here, I feel a little sick. <coughs> I've enclosed this deed at the to that place. My pride and joy, Afro Apples Farm, it's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast, is the perfect place to start your new life. <laughs> this is my pr most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you beat honor your family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. Louis is still alive. Oh, Louis is still alive. Say hi to the old guy for me, will you? Why is there an arrow pointing down at that sign? Am I feels like I'm gonna click that arrow and then <coughs> jump the I, I no idea what's going on right here. Stardew Valley. Hello, you must be Afrojack. I'm Robin. <coughs> Jeez, okay. I'm Robin, local carpenter. Major Major Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the Ah <coughs> oh, jeez, I can't control this coughing. 
I'd show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things for your arrival. <coughs> the farm's right over here if you follow me. This is Afro Apple's farm. <coughs> yeah, what does that water mean? Thirsty? What's the matter? It's a bit overgrown, but... Oh, sweat, that's what I mean. I meant you were thirsty. Okay. I'm an idiot. Alright. I'm gonna like do the intro. Oh. A little dedication to you, I have cleaned up in no time. Good thing I'm recording here because I would have missed that. Lewis, ah, the new farmer. Aren't you the guy I was supposed to say hi to? You don't look so old. Hello? Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves on. It's quite a big deal. So you, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. That's a good house. Very rustic. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more opt though. Don't listen to Afrojack. He's just trying to make you satisfied so you buy one of your house upgrades. Hey, I'll buy one for house upgrades. I'll buy every house upgrade. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and then introduce yourself. Townspeople like will appreciate that. Alright, goodbye, you. <coughs> oh, I'm a scrap. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box right here. Now come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. Let me get into the game already. <laughs> that is not how a chicken sounds like. I know it. I have a chicken coop. Alright. Run. Okay, move. WASD. I'm glad with that. Run shift. Ooh, I'm not running. Hello? Alright, Parson of Seeds, new journal entry, okay. You see, first part, here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Uh, crap, what am I supposed to do? Uh, okay, I, I just have to add my thing, alright. Slick channel, weather report, force teller living off the land. Looks like living off the land. We're big here back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. This one's for all your greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for all for it. Search some casts while waiting on your first harvest. Uh, fortune telling, welcome to Wellwick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you come to the right place. It's a very displeased day and will do your best. Okay. I uh, might have to stop right here. Maybe we'll start recording again and I'll see you when I, when I uh, get more things done. And uh, yeah. I'll probably stop recording here right now and start recording again and you know, I can jump into another part of the time because right now it's getting pretty slow in this uh, game so I'm gonna start recording once I get st stuff started and uh, I can show you what happened what I did all right all right so I am back here again after like few hours actually is a few hours after I recorded that first bit and uh, I've done a bit of stuff been doing a bit of uh, working on things I haven't got much done I've only gotten 50 minutes logged in here but I have uh, been getting uh, getting this quest done uh, I right now have like 22 out of 28 people greeted this right here I have no idea but uh, the funny thing, it, funny thing is, is that throughout the first day, apparently I got so fatigued that my character passed out, and I ended up having to, uh, and I ended up, like my character ended up went going to sleep, and I ended up missing the whole day. Anyway, I got a bit of stuff after uh, I cut it, but yeah, and a bit of stuff has been done. I haven't done a lot too too much but let's see if I can come in here let's see if I can go in the sewer let's see if I can greet anybody there it's straight up locked I am trying to get this introduction uh, this introduction uh, quest out of the way okay let's see if that adds up to my introductions nope okay nothing that's a lot of stuff uh, yeah I'm gonna try to get this introduction thing done I really hope I do get it done today, like as in the in-game day right now, because uh, I also discovered that on the, apparently on the seventh day, 
there's gonna be it's gonna be someone's birthday on that day I also discovered that this is a thing too and uh, the maps a thing too and that really helped with getting around the place because before I was really confused but now I pretty much know my way around the place and pretty much I kind of memorized most of it most of it I haven't been around the whole place but I memorized most of it uh, let's see here I also don't have a shovel that's interesting too uh, you have all these tools but I don't have a shovel let's see here I haven't been to every part yet let's see here let's see if I can meet anybody here uh, yeah I had a nice walk I'm just trying to find someone here hey you knew it's probably gonna be a while until I actually get something interesting happening right here. But until then, it's gonna be quite boring. I do like the music in here though, it is quite peaceful. Uh, anybody in here? Can't seem to find anybody. It's so hard to find people here, like, who do I greet? Like, where, where do I go at? I have no idea if this like village is randomly generated because it kind of seems like it is. I, I know like barely anything about this game. Oh hi there. Good finally I meet someone. I, mean, I have no idea what to do. I uh, guess I'll just talk about stuff. I don't know. Daffodil. Yeah it's honestly been a while since I played the steps games. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like this game. Because it's more of a different style of game, like more of a slow paced game, like Animal Crossing. Like, uh, like Animal Crossing is a pretty good game. But like, there's like, let's see if I can go on the street. Uh, like, because Animal Crossing, like, the similarities between, like, it's supposed to be like Harvest Moon, but. Yeah, I'm not getting much excitement out of this. I'm probably gonna have to cut a lot of this out. Yeah, I'm gonna end it off right here. This is not an exciting thing. Okay, I'll stop recording. Alright, thanks for watching. Goodbye. Alright, what's up? So, I don't know if I'm gonna release the first vid, but, but, uh, uh, oh yeah. I forgot to mention I'm playing Stardew Valley, but I don't know if I'm going to release the first bit of it because it's honestly pretty boring when I look back at it or when I recorded it. So, uh, yeah, I'm playing Stardew Valley and I've heard of this game quite a bit and I've heard, I heard it was pretty good. It was like a mix between, uh, let's see here, mix, well, not really a mix. It's more of like a newer version of Harvest Moon and it's and I've never played that game before, but I have played Animal Crossing, which is sort of like this game where it's not really about all action and stuff. It's sort of like a tycoon game, except not. It's more of a, I, I, it's kind of hard to explain these types of games, but I do like these types of games. And okay, I really wish it didn't like, if I could like have a way to save uh, my, my thing when like in the middle of a, this, the game, but I'm not able to do that. All right, first thing I already have a farm starter right here. I have a bean starter, which I that's why I looked at. I uh, saw it, so I had said that I could it whenever I started it, it and after 10 days it starts producing more plants. I right, got some question. I'm probably gonna do this quest right here, uh, maybe that quest and that quest later. I don't know, maybe I should spend the morning, uh, uh, chopping down trees, yeah. I feel like that's a good way. Oh, funny. Saw him there, man. Uh, I wonder what happens if I go up there and interact with it. Uh, pillow? Nope. Why not? Yeah. Okay, yeah, uh, there's nothing that happens whenever I interact. Well, I haven't done with the scythe yet, though. Yeah. On the first day of my, of my playing this is... I didn't know that this this meant energy, so I ended up uh, passing my character out and pretty much failing at everything. Let's see what I got in here. I got plenty of wood, but I do think I should have more, should collect more wood right here. So I'm gonna chop this tree down. See how much. 
I also learned that these trees give off fiber trees. And, uh, I'm thinking of, like, like, I'm not really chopping all of this down and cutting all this down because I want to, like, I, I want to have materials, but I also want to su sustain, uh, stuff as much as possible because I've kind of figured out that, uh, okay, that was weird. <coughs> uh, just, I saw in, like, one dialogue where it said that you should sustain your resources because if you don't, then you'll probably end up, oh, Oh really? Okay, I I can have a pine cone. Okay, looks like I'll plant this. Um, where should I plant this seed? How do I get rid of these? Uh, okay, I guess I can just do that. I feel like it's a good what a thing to just get rid of that, those stumps just to get it out of the way. Am I supposed to? Okay, I guess I can just do that. Uh, water it. Guess so. Uh, I'm just watering it just in case. I feel like these holes uh, give off the best, yeah, I feel like that's the best way to plant those seedlings. I, I don't know. I do want to refill my water watering can, but I really do have to get to that uh, nursing. Because time moves really fast in this game. It moves like super fast. And I uh, kind of want to check out the hospital. I only checked it out for like a few seconds and kind of want to check it out more. Okay, yeah, uh, there's also like certain people, like there's actually like certainly certain named people. It's like, it's not like, well, it's not, it's not like there's like everyone's, there's like this random NPCs, NPCs like actually have personality. There's each and every character. Oh, there, there's the wizard. Yeah, I forgot about him. Uh, hi there. On your first, your body too hard in the store exhaustion. Ah, that's. These are way too expensive, man. Uh, anyway, I can just talk to you. Like, just talk to you like a normal person. I really wish I... How does no one come up with that? How come this is the only thing that came up with that? This clan is likes medical practice by the Fengo Public Health Authority. Uh, let's go in here and get some seeds because uh, I do kind of want to grow some seeds. Cauliflower seeds. Takes 12 days. Get some parsnip seeds, probably three of those, four of those actually, and uh, uh, grass starter, jazz seeds. Let's get some jazz seeds. Some of like I think three of them would be good. Yeah. Okay, I got some jazz seeds. All right, let's go. Let's plant these seeds. Wait, place this on. Oh yeah, I also got maple seeds too. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna have to start trying to organize my farm if I ever do want to have a good farm in this game I, I don't know what I don't know if I need to like feed it like some kind of food or something but yeah uh, okay plant that right there water it uh, maybe I do want to sell some stuff like like this tree sap let's see here I don't think there's any reason to have this tree sap let me see in the crafting Yep, there is, okay. Got all that, and just sell this one piece of sap right here. Goodbye, sap. Uh, mix into tilled soil. Okay, it has to be added before planting, okay. I'm just gonna keep that into my, put that in my chest. Hopefully I remember it. How long is, it's closed 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. and it's closed Wednesday, okay, that's interesting. Should this town have a church? I kind of feel like this town should have a church. I don't know. Hi there, lady. Hey, lady. I'm guessing that this one lady, uh, who, let me see if I can find him in the social. Uh, who is it? Pam. But yeah, this, I feel like this I can give a gift to. Pam. Because I feel like she's the e easiest to figure out. Uh, I do have not a lot of energy, though. Let's see what else I can do. Let's try going to the docks. See what can I can find there. I don't know where I'm gonna find coal though. I have no idea where I'm gonna find coal at. <coughs> I feel like I find those in like mines. Also, if you're wondering if I haven't been uploading recently, I just haven't really been feeling like uploading YouTuber lately. 
just kind of been lazy about it, just kind of slacking off a bit. You know, I just kind of want to enjoy my own stuff. I was watching a few shows. That... Does this train track lead somewhere? Nope. I. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So this right here, Joe Jamar. Like, so there. Here's this guy right here. If I get a membership of JoJo membership, then I would end up getting a where a thing taken down and I think I showed you that now just so you understand what I'm trying to preserve here because I mean I guess it's just easier if you see it in the story but uh yeah so this place is has a lot of mysterious places right here I wonder if I go back to the wizard place if I go back to the wi yeah, uh, time moves so fast. Like, let me show my recording. Let me see how long I've been recording. Uh, 14 minutes, actually. Okay. Yeah, I'm probably going to combine this with my other episode. Although, I do admit it wasn't very exciting. Uh, maybe I'll go into another day. I don't know. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm going to go. No, I wouldn't say. Um, I There's not much else to do. Other than collect some stuff, maybe. Oh, there's some fiber that goes from that. Maybe I'll need that. I'm just gonna need to clean up all this stuff from my yard. It's getting annoying. Alright. Put this fiber in here. Okay. Yeah, it's raining right now. That means my crops are automatically, uh... That means my crops are automatically watered, so that's good. Uh, let's go right here. So it's Monday right now, and let me look at the calendar. See if there's anything go going on right here. There is. I have I have a craving for seaweed. Nah, I'm not gonna take that quest. I'm trying to look at the calendar. Yeah, okay. And that's Vincent's birthday. The egg festival. Okay. Maybe I should get prepared for the egg festival. See if that. See what happens right there. Ah, you know what I should have done? I should have gone to the Star Drop Saloon and played that one game. I don't know. Maybe I should start quitting here. Okay. Yeah. I'm not. No, that's gonna save. Okay. Uh, I guess it's just black screen now, okay? So, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I was pretty bored doing it. I, I find it, I'm not very good when it comes to just improvised commentary without any plans at all. But I'll try and get better at it. I'll try and get better. Anyways, uh, I do hope you enjoyed the video and goodbye.